Hello, welcome to Tarot with TJ. I am TJ, and today is your daily reading for January 13th, 2022. This is a pick a card style reading. We have three different groupings. Each have an Angel Oracle deck card and two Smith White Tarot cards. Before we got together, I connected with Spirit and asked what message could I share with someone today and uh, how can we be helpful? Seems like my kitty cat has joined us and uh, let's get to it. Oh, in the, in the description box below, you will see timestamps if you would like to jump to your particular reading. Uh, we have different messages on these candles, inspirational, thoughtful, and you certainly choose the reading uh, with the message that uh, resonates with you. The first candle has the message of be calm, be calm, and sparkle. The second candle has the message of, uh, which is yellow, be calm and enjoy life. And the third candle, which is orange, has the message of be calm and be yourself. Let's get started with the first grouping, be calm and sparkle. Your message for today. Okay. All right. You have the Angel Oracle deck card, Creative Project. And it says, your soul longs to express itself in creative ways. We're guiding you to infuse artistry and creativity in your life. Creative expression makes you feel alive and excited and reignites passion towards your life. Now you have that in combination with the Six of Cups, with this, which is Sansa Stark and Rob Stark um, reuniting after a very long time. Um, and we also have, oh, I got wax on the card. Mm, that's life. I can clean it up. We also have the Justice card, which is Ned Stark with the Scales of Justice. Oh, he was betrayed, if you remember, or if you watched the Game of Thrones series. And if you didn't know, uh, the Smith White Tarot that I'm using today is of the Game of Thrones uh, series. It's my favorite deck. It's one that I connect with very much so with Spirit. So um, Pink Candle Group, your message is telling me that uh, for today, you, ha you might receive a visitor from the past. And um, for perhaps this is because you've been working on something creatively, which has drawn them to you, which is positive and can be a very positive interaction. But perhaps this interaction is also, it's an opportunity for you to um, take responsibility for something that had happened. And that reconciliation will definitely have a positive impact in whatever it is that you're, you know, working on, even if it's a personal project, uh, just working on yourself. So uh, Pink Candle Group, that's the message that I see for you today. Someone from your past might um, come out and or you might seek them and there's something that you're trying to reconcile for that will only help with your growth. That's beautiful. Any chance to grow and to make right on a past wrong or you know a past challenge is a wonderful opportunity for growth and uh, you know it just shows that you are progressing in your journey on this earth as a human being. So Pink Candle Group, good for you for taking that, um, for using your energy to, you know, take those actions and do something nice, do something great. So let's move on to the second grouping, and that's the Yellow Candle, Enjoy Life. It's important that we all do something each day to enjoy our lives. You know, my name is T, uh, and I do enjoy drinking tea. Often I have a cup with me when I'm filming these videos. Sometimes you can see the handle. Um... Yeah, and you know, you can find joy in small things or in larger things, but make sure you make an effort to enjoy something in your day and, you know, really enjoy it. Plug out and really enjoy it. All right, yellow group, let's see what uh, what cards you have drawn today. Oh, lovely. You have the angel oracle deck card, which is ask, and there's an angel praying with the moon behind them, the full moon. Um, and your card says, Ask us to help you in this situation and we will immediately go to work on your behalf. We are governed by many universal laws and among them is the free will that allows you to make your own choices and decisions. So we patiently await your request. What is it you're asking for in your life right now, yellow group? Oh, say it out loud. Zero in what it is that you're asking for because you have the Four of Coins and the King of Spears. And that tells me that whatever it is that you're asking for, as you can see, this representative of the Iron Bank, um, you can receive and it can bring you financial stability and comfort. Um, just be mindful not to become a miser, but the potential, whatever it is that you're asking for, is related to financial stability today. Oh, your candle just went out too. Make sure you're not working too hard, okay? 
Don't, and be careful not to... Money isn't always the end goal. Absolutely, money is important. It brings comfort in ways. But it's not everything, okay? And that's interesting. Your candle just went out. So you have that in combination with the King of Spears. And the King of Spears tells me, uh, you know, you've been working on something that you're passionate about. Perhaps today you are having a light bulb moment. Like, oh my gosh, you know what? This is what I could be doing. This is the way I could go about something. Whatever that is, is directly related to you gaining financial stability you gaining balance in something and you have a moment of uh, like again a light mall moment a moment of eureka and it's what you've been asking for in order to achieve that goal so yellow group this is fantastic you know go with that go with that um insight it is the answer to what it is that you've been asking for and it definitely has a potential to bring you stability but don't but don't forget money isn't everything i hope you enjoyed your reading for today yellow group and i hope that whatever it is that um, has sparked your creativity or whatever your eureka light bulb moment was it brings you success good luck let's move on to the last reading for january 13th 2022 and we have the orange candle group and the orange is i'm not going to burn myself today be yourself keep calm and be yourself so your reading orange card group orange candle group sorry Oh, nice. You have the Joy Angel Oracle deck card and the card, oh, it's of an angel on a dolphin. I would love to go on a dolphin ride if I felt safe, but I totally wouldn't. So in my imagination, perhaps I will go on an angel on a dolphin, um, on a dolphin ride. Okay. I'm just talking nonsense now. Joy is the highest energy of all. It's the magical sense that everything is possible. Joy springs from appreciating the gifts within each moment. Joy allows you to attract and create your present and future moments at their highest possible levels. Ah, oh, orange card. What's bringing you joy today? Oh, okay. Well, according to these two cards, here you have um, an unsullied going against the sons of the harpy. There's one against three. And here you also have um the knight of spears i believe this is gray worm by the way this guy survived the attack and here we have jamie lannister the king slayer he represents passion drive um speed and action so what the, your reading orange candle group is telling me today is you are going to have a pretty awesome day it's going to be one where you might encounter some um, opposition, but it's only going to fire you up and bring out your passion. Um, perhaps uh, you need to work towards getting a love interest, you know, maybe you're having a bit of that, um, you know, you, you're, you're going to be on the chase of something. It could be something creatively as well. Anyways, you're going to really enjoy it. So I hope you enjoy your hunt. Is it going to be romantic? Because this, the Knight of Spears also indicates like a, a, a a very passionate romance and the seven of spears is also passion but challenge so i wonder what type of challenge is going to ignite your passion today is it love related business oh i don't know please tell me i love love so if it is i really want to hear about it all right if this reading pertains to you today let me know in the comments below i hope you enjoyed it and have a great january 13th 2022 bye